So, you know, people ask me, um, do you like administration? The truth is, or, or is it bother you, you know? The truth is that I don't feel like I administer anything. You know, I have a department administrator. <laughs> he tells me if we're in the red or in the black. Yeah. I feel like I'm a cheerleader for my faculty, you know? I am a scientific cheerleader. And also, I'm sort of, I have all my antennas up for any sort of uh, uh, opportunity for any one of them, you know. If I can name them to some award or send them to some training or name them to a study section, all of those things require a lot of work on their part. But it's good for them in terms of, you know, building their career. So I have a sense that I would do exactly the same thing, whether I'm in the chair's office or not. And being in the chair's office, gives me more clout to actually get these things accomplished. So I've always been very interested in the career development of, uh, of my junior colleagues, of my students and postdocs. Um, people have always come to me uh, unofficially for advice, et cetera. And, and what I could do is give advice and put their names up and, you know, but with this just, you know, a little bit increased authority, I'm able to do it much better. And that's one of the reasons why I said yes to, to being a chair. The other reason was that we didn't have a Department of Immunology at the University of Pittsburgh. There were many immunologists, and we liked to congregate, et cetera. But what happens is that when other chairs sit around the table and, and resources are discussed, et cetera, there's nobody representing immunologists. So, so I thought it was a, a very deserving group of people that needed a seat at the table. And I was sort of the most visible and most senior in that group. So, so for them, I would not have probably applied for a chair position at some other institution that I knew was open or when people came after me, which you know they do all the time, I'd, I'd say, no, I'm really not moving. But in my own institution, um, after about 10 years of being with the same group of people and trying to promote them and, and uh, working with them, it was really a benefit uh, to say yes.